Oh no, Robo. <laughs> Hey everybody, this is Pwned over at Ono Robo, and I am back for part two, which is the main part of the story, in Darkwood, the open access game from Acid Wizard Studios. Um, I just started back up here, as you can see I'm talking to this strange looking guy here. Um, and I already did this beginning part before, just so I made sure I was a little bit familiar with it, but um, he's talking about where his hideout is, etc. He gives you the bucket. Um, so, I didn't play very long. This is pretty much going to be a blind walkthrough, um, which I think is more exciting. And I mean, you might think it's more boring. I don't. Um, I'm going to show him the dog tag. And you can read this text if you want while I'm talking. Um, I, I just think that playing the game this way kind of makes it a little bit more fun. If I don't know what's going to happen, you know, I can't really tell you what to expect. Um, so that's what we're doing here. We're just going to kind of go through it. I'm going to try to keep the commentary to a bit of a minimum. Um, let's see. Trade. What do I need here? Is there something I can get from you that would help me? A gas mask? An axe would be nice. Can I not get the axe? How about a flare? Can I get any of this? Yes, I can. Thank you. All right. Gossip. Okay, yeah. So a big a big part of this game, and as you can see here, I'm in a house. Uh, the wolf man is here. Uh, he leaves after a little while. Now, you can walk around in this hideout. You've got... You're a different character now. You're the guy that, after the prologue, gets picked up. And I'll just kind of show you what's in this house here. Um, you've got a lamp that you can switch on and off. However... You can't really do anything with it yet because you have to turn on the generator. So first we're going to take a look in the wardrobe. There's nothing in there. Okay. Uh, but the thing is, the generator doesn't last very long. And you can find... Okay, definitely can't do this yet. Um, so I don't think I have anything in the journal that... Do I have any notes? Dog tag? How about... Let's look at the dog tag. Oh. 1918? Maybe that's it. Let's try that. One, nine, one, eight. Oh, oh, it's wrong. I thought it unlocked. Damn it. Well, anyway, <laughs> let's just keep going here. All right, so you've got a few things in this hideout. And one thing, one thing I want to show you too, you have an oven where you can cook. And the thing is, you can actually cook. Um, and once this fills up, you'll get, you'll unlock an ability that you can choose and, and when I did it I could choose between three um, you can also as I said before you can barricade windows but I can't do that right now I don't have the right materials and you have to go out to find materials and that's where the game gets kind of tough all right so there's a wardrobe here one thing you'll have to notice too or that you need to notice is that there's just an open freaking wall here that doesn't offer you much protection so what I suggest is you grab onto this thing And if there's ever a problem like that, move something in front of it. Okay? No light coming in. That means that it's covered. Now, I don't know how much protection that's going to give me, but... Um, all right. So we're going we're gonna to just go ahead and go outside and get started here. Um, and again, this is a blind walkthrough. I did play this for a few minutes the other day just to kind of get familiar with it, but I didn't do much, so I don't really know what I'm doing right now. All right. So the well. I do know this. So I can use the bucket here. The bucket is in. Now, you cannot drink the water during the day. The well only fills up at night. And the problem with that is that at nighttime, that's when most of the creatures in the game come out. And you need to be inside. Um, now, over here, I'll just show you real quick. And again, I'm not very good at running. I'm trying. It's just not easy for me to run. Okay. Um, there's a little shack back here, and there is a generator. But I would rather not use the generator. As you can see down here at the bottom of the screen, that shows you how much fuel's in the generator. So I need to fill it up a little bit more. There's a corpse here. I need to fill it up a little bit more before I, uh, you know, really do much. Okay, so we're going to leave, and we're going to go ahead, and you can check the map with M. So you see here you've got um, underground entrance is over here. 
Now, this is interesting because the last time I played, the underground entrance was down here. It has moved. So that, go that tells me right now that the game changes a bit every time you play it, which is cool. That's good. It kind of keeps you on your toes. So I guess this really is a blind rock walkthrough because I haven't done anything like that. Okay, that looks like something, but it's not anything. Okay, let's run. Let's get on the move, baby. Okay. Again, I'm going to try to keep the commentary to a minimum. I'm, I know I talk a lot, but it does get boring if I don't. Okay, so... Not that the game's boring, it just might be boring if you're just watching me play without talking a little bit. Okay. There we go. Crate. Oh, yes. What do we got here? Junk, match tick, and another 9 volt battery. Okay, I'll take some junk. I'll take some match sticks. That's cool. Let's keep on walking. Let's look around. Now, I don't think I should go to the underground entrance right now because I don't really have a lot of supplies. I need to look at Oh, that's not good. That's not good. Oh, God! Ah! He's chasing me. Ah! Go, 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 go,
All right, that's good enough. A lock pick will be, will be good. Okay. Anything else around his campsite that I can use? Switch on the lamp. Of course, he doesn't have a generator. Search the crate. I wonder if he'll attack me if I confirm. Wrong code. Of course it is. I wonder what you have to do to figure out what his codes are. I wonder if you can kill him at some point and just figure out his codes. I'm not going to try, though. I don't think I want to kill him. I want him on my side. All right, so now I have his camp, which is great. That means on my map, I've got Wolfman right here. Now, again, I, I, I kind of need to search around because going to the underground is probably not a good idea right now. Okay, that's not good. Okay, that's not good at all. These dogs are aggressive as shit. I don't want to mess with those dogs. Just walk slowly. Don't, don't aggravate him. Okay, I see that, but there's just bugs coming out of it. Those are pretty big bugs. If you look at in proportion of the guy, that's those are pretty gigantic. Alright, let's keep going. Broken tractor. And this is in a different spot from where I found it last time, so that's this is cool. I like this. It's I guess it's I don't I wouldn't necessarily say procedurally generated, but it's got something different every time you play. Okay. Pellet. Okay, battery, perfect, and gasoline, yes. That helps for the generator, okay, which I'll definitely need. But the other thing, too, that I noticed is that when you're in your house and you're barricaded up at night, you have to be careful because, oh, what's this? Pig shed. Okay, let's check it out. You have to be careful because, um, oh, I can't go over that. Gotta be a way in here, right? Um, if you make um, if you make too much noise or you you move around too much, the creatures outside will hear you and they'll come after you. Okay, this looks like hot meat. Throwable can be used as bait for carnivores. Nice. What else? Anything else I can check? Wood box. Search. Nope. 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 Nothing there. What about this tent? How about in here? Can I go in here? I know there's an opening over here. So you want to try to be in a place of oh, pig heads? I must return to my hideout before nightfall to drink from the well. Yes, I know. If I look and smell of these dismembered heads, it seems they have been here for quite some time. Okay. that do? Nothing? Oh crap, that doesn't sound good. I have never been here, everyone, so I don't know what's going to happen in here if there's anyone in here. Get out of here, you fucking freak. Who's in here? <laughs> oh god! That was probably a stupid move. I'm leaving, I'm leaving, I'm leaving. I'm leaving. God. What's wrong with you? Oh god! Ah! Go, 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 go. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, dude. I'm sorry. Get off of me, man. Oh, God, I'm... My control... I suck at these controls. Oh, God, he's beating the shit out of me. Oh, no. What the hell just happened? Oh, God. Each time you die, you lose your recently added skills. All of your items get a durability hit and mutated items disappear. Great. Now I'm on day two because I got the shit kicked out of me by a random homeless dude. Which I should have known better than to break into some dude's house and try to steal his shit. But hey, that's what we do here. Alright, so... <laughs> of course! Okay, Patrick, get... Oh, God. Okay. I gotta get these controls down. Okay, let's go ahead and just see if I can cook anything in the oven. <sighs> Nothing. Can't... Can't cook my gasoline. Can't cook the meat. I might as well go ahead and put the gas that I've gotten into the generator for later, because I'm gonna need it. Oh my god. What the what was that? What did I just step in? What happened to me? What are those status effects? Poison, I'm poisoned, and I move slower. Great. I'm po crap. What did I step on? Oh, I'm gonna have to watch that replay. What? And I can't drink from the well, because the well's dry. 
Oh man. I'm poisoned. Great. Probably gonna die now. This is my running speed now. Because I've been poisoned. Damn it! Alright. Let's put some gas in the generator. Wait, no, 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 no. Can I use the... Where's my gas? Let's put the gas in one here. I wonder if this is going to end up killing me. Refill. So you refill the generator by holding the right mouse button and holding the or holding the right mouse button and then holding the left mouse button to pour it all out. So the tank is empty. Now again, I'm not going to use this right now, and I'm also not going to go that way again. As you see on the map, the pig shed underground entrance. I don't want to go there yet. I'm going to go up here. I've got to find something, even though I probably shouldn't be walking around out here because I'm poisoned. And this is not good. And as you can see on the outer sides of the screen, like there's like nasty little bubbles. Like I'm not feeling good. I have a feeling I'm gonna die a lot. What is that? Oh my! What the? Ah! What is that? What? What was that, man? Oh my god! Oh my god! Get back! Ah! Jump the fence! No! Don't! All right, fuck it. Just run, just run, just run. He's not gonna, he can't stay on you that long. Go, 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 go. Right? There's no way, and I'm not poisoned anymore. I've got to get a weapon. I have to find a weapon. This is not working out for me. If I don't find a weapon, I'm screwed. Is it getting nighttime already? Oh my god, there's a dog. This is not going well for me, everyone. This is not working out the way that I thought it would because I'm... Is that a dead rabbit? Yeah, give me the rabbit meat. Give me, give me the rabbit meat right now. These are rocks. That's what those dudes are throwing at... What's that sound? Did you... Did, am, I, am I hearing things? I know I just heard something. Oh my god. What is that? What is that? What is... What is... Oh my god! Ow! Oh, shit! Ugh. Okay, so this is just survival right now. Because I'm getting attacked. I'm fucking... I'm running somewhere else. I'm not going back to my house every time. I gotta find stuff. I gotta find a weapon. Just just go crazy. Just run. Yeah, you can't... Fuck. Wait, something's behind me. You're still behind me?! No! Oh! Oh my god, I'm getting tired. I can't run anymore. He is behind me. He is behind me, and I can't get away. What is he? Oh my god. This is crazy. Oh my god. Just run. Run, 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 run. The pig shed again? Pig shed? He's still chasing me. I cannot... Can I jump the fence? Jump the fence. Alright, yeah, what now? Can he jump the fence? Nope. Oh my god, he can. Oh no, it's the crazy dude again! Oh my god. So, I'm just gonna go ahead and say it. Like, I am not doing so well, and this is a lot different than it happened last time. It's already day three, and I've been killed twice. I think we're gonna call it a stopping point right here. Uh, I'm gonna call this video, I suck. <laughs> that, or I've just got really bad luck. Hopefully we can dive into some more of the other mechanics. Uh, blind walkthroughs, guys. This is the way it works. Um, I'm going to die probably a lot, but at least you get to see me hopefully get better as we do more. So uh, we'll pick up next time from day three. Uh, this is Pwned Over and Owner Robo. Be sure to like, subscribe, and comment. And be sure to check out the next video coming soon so we can pick up right where we left off. And I promise it won't be a long wait. Thanks.